City police chief. Not elected position, says Mayor Rogers. If my nephew wants to lead the police, I support him. Ah, fuck him. <laughs> Mayor proves his commitment to nepotism. Ah, I love the Goldenberg. Looks like the janitor hasn't been around to clean the toilet today. I don't know about you, but I care about my cleanliness of my intimacy. <laughs> no. You're a real class act, you know that? No. Jeez. Yeah, he's pretty low. Okay, yes, yeah, of all, go home. Don't even come back. Don't even come in tomorrow. Just go home. Oh. Hey, hey. Now, this is applied for all shifts, so I'm going to hold off on this stripe um, until the end of the day. I'll, I'll review people for it. And now, do we have anything new or same old, same old? Yeah. Well, let's scratch a new beat. It's this one. Way too cheery. I'm <laughs> not feeling this. City Hall hire female cops. Considering certain recent events, we are obligated to grant some concession to the feminists. You are to make sure that at least half of the staff at the police station are women. You have three days. So I have to fire my fucking... That's ridiculous. I don't mind hiring female cop, but I can't fire half my staff for... Wow. Damn it, I wanted to increase my, my SWAT, but... And this will take too long, I think. Yeah. Oh, I can send multiple. I feel like an idiot. Let's just guarantee... I don't know what the odds are, so... Let's do these two. No, wait. I need more detectives, actually. It's gonna be weird. Alright. Uh, labor market. Well... Okay, some of these numbers are promising, too. So I'm not too... I'm not too beat up about that. Yeah, you know what? Class, you can take, I can take, class can take a hike. Oh, man. How many people we got here? Ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Was it just police officers? Uh, oh my gosh. How do I find those missions? Uh, I can't. I do not know how to find those missions. Damn. Alright, what's the suicide threat? Detector heard someone screaming. They noticed a few people gathering on the bridge as he was driving by towards the port. He stopped to see if anyone needed help, but as he approached, he saw a man who was threatening to throw himself and two children into the icy waters below. Oh, man. Jason left us. I lost my job. There's no way we'll survive. It's better when everything ends now. Taxi driver looked to the taxi driver. It looked like suicide. Alright. Let's... Throw our juniors in on this. I can't imagine more than really needing two, but... I'm just gonna throw two in on this. Uh, I really want to know if, like, what did it say? Half all my staff or half all my cops? It's a staff, actually. Element speaking in a raspy whisper. Just reported a break in. Someone's inside my house. They're pounding on the door and marching all around downstairs. Hurry. Oh, God. I don't, I'm not gonna send SWAT for this. We'll send two people. 
I don't believe you. I think you're lying. Well, that'd be fucked up if it was true, though. Dude, everything's happening today. Disorderly conduct. Secretary Abigail Jones told the police that her boss, Martin Quebec, returned from a meeting in quite a state. When he entered, he took a bag of white powder from his safe and shut the door. Now he is yelling insistently, incessantly, and making a scene, demanding that the secretary deliver him to the deliver him the head of a unicorn, or he'll cut her throat with a letter opener, and then go after the rest of her family. Yeah, well, fuck that guy. Send two here. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping this wasn't what it was, but it did sound like it. Two tearful boys, clearly in a state of shock, are standing dangerously close to the edge of a bridge. Beside them, their drunk and distraught father is slowly pushing the children closer to the precipice. Oh my gosh, I'm really scared now. He said a man's name, not a woman. So I'm assuming he means uh, his husband. Don't worry there, everything's going to be fine. Don't be upset, my friend. Tell him about your husband. A strong gust of wind almost blows one of the children off the ridge, but he recovers at the last moment and stumbles to the ground with a scuffed knee. Oh, God. Oh, man. Um... State back, try not to aggravate the man. Oh my gosh, the man slurs his words, saying there's no point denying the inevitable. The children have their whole lives in front of them. You can't make this decision for them. Don't say this. He's already thinking about it. And he, he thinks there's nobody who cares about him. And pointing the gun, tell him to step away from the edge. I mean, suicidal. I don't know if this would... The fear of death would really work here. Uh... I... How the hell did he escape? Okay. I'm gonna chalk that up as, uh, not as bad as it could have been. I'm happy. What happened? There was no one except a dog in the house. They scratched the door because he wanted to go outside. I knew it. Destruction of property. A young drunken biker broke into the church. Rode around between the pews. Defiled the sacred crucifix and fled the scene. This guy looks like a badass. All right. Proceed with the investigation. Oh. What? No white powder? Yeah! Uh... I might do it like every other time, maybe. Bring it to the police station this time. We'll do... Uh, I'll alternate between the two. Sand. A member of the family was... out at a restaurant having dinner with his secret lover. But, because the affair was secret, he was light on protection, and one of the Vargas agents was able to slip a grenade into the room. Oh, man. Alright. I got a couple... I got a few seconds. Um... Oh, no, these guys are going to it. Oh, yeah, they're all back. Okay. Uh... Hmm. Let's put these two in on it. Oh man, don't move. <laughs> be terrible. <laughs> All right, so let's start this uh, destruction of property investigation. Some guy rode around in the church. What do the witnesses have to say? 
I've been going to Sunday service for 36 years, and this is the first time I've ever seen such a disgrace. Some crazy young man on a motorcycle drove straight through the doors of God's temple and began running around, shouting blasphemy. He even dared raise his hands to Holy Father Nuzit? Nunits? What is it with the youths today? Those youths! Hang on, hang on, hang on. Drove straight through the guns. Began running around, trying to blast me. Okay, maybe it's just figure speech. It all happened so quickly. The man drove straight between the pews, almost crushing a petitioner. Then he looked into the confessional, threw a bottle. He ran up to me, shouting, The devil sits at the roof of the church. Then he shoved me. I fell to the floor. The crazy man shouted. Okay. Oh my god, these are dense. At the crime scene, we found a black helmet with white spots on top. On the pavement near the church, found traces of three motorcycle tiles. Okay, so there's definitely more to this. We're just gonna have to wait for the investigation to gather more intel. This sucks. Oh man. Oh, that's so creepy. It's like I'm underwater. Put a little jams on. Oh man. Grenade seed. Oh. Let's hope they can fix this explosive situation. 710 in progress. Oh, I love that. Delicious. What the hell? Hostage situation with a fatal casualty. Bank of Freeburg. A man wearing a suit walked into the lobby of the bank, locked the doors, proceeded to kill several customers. He never said a word. He just started firing at people, reported one eyewitness. A dozen people remained inside the building. And the criminal's demands are not yet known. Woo! Alright. We need our top men on this. That's a heavy one. We're getting close to the end of the day. And then again, the crazies come out at night, don't they? Oh, I guess, yeah, the situation was resolved. Wow. I was trying to raise 10 water starting to pop up. Hmm. Zim Birch. He's the bitch of the day. Of course, Sam needs help right now. God damn it. A sweet girl named Anna is one of our key assets in a large accounting firm. She just got home from work and found her home was on fire. And the assholes that started it are standing around admiring their handiwork. Wouldn't it be pretty if someone cracked open their skulls and tossed them into the flames? Sure. You guys can get on that. Class can just sit there and scrub the toilets for all I care. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. That resolved quick. I thought I would at least have some... Some interaction. Huh. What, no weapon? Lame. Lame. I wish there was a way, yeah, like, I, I wish I could see, like, the missions for City Hall. There has to be something. It's not in affairs, right? No. These are all, like, my little, like, abilities. Oh, I'm an idiot. Right, it was in backlogs. Half of the staff. Okay, that's different. Half of the staff. Ooh. All right, how's this hit and run looking? Oh, wow, yeah, I forgot all about this one, yeah. Hmm. Walked in, they got into the car. Oh, that's...
this. What am I missing here? Oh, it's a dark car. I mean, it's a red car. Wait, wait, wait. I saw two people call the one right by the man. Beard. All right. Well, all these have men with beards. Or have a man with a beard. Uh, Taking the left down the bar, fighting with some locals. I think it was Paul. A dark-colored car came tearing through the corner. All right. Then I don't. I don't think I have enough because I need. I just need this like black car because unless there's some order here, I'm missing. Oh. didn't happen at all. This did. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to assume that we don't have enough for this one. Okay, destruction of property. Let's see what we got now for this. This guy looks so radical. Silly. Yeah, we definitely don't have enough. Joke around in the pews. I got this twice. Swinging a bottle around? Yeah, I'm gonna have to like read this detailed. And he had a helmet left behind. Does that mean like he was holding something or was he wearing it when he came in? Uh, a few seconds later, a young man with a black jacket opened the door. The confession on the L. Uh, seek out the devil, wherever he may hide. And then he threw a bottle at me. Don't have enough. That's a shame. I, oh my gosh, this is gonna be so tricky. Okay, got a uh, one more hour. I think it. I think it would be. No, that's it. We're good. Calling it. San is definitely in the lead, which is what I was aiming for. Okay, half my staff. Alright. So that's, uh, 16. Yeah. Oh, boy. So we've got... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Ugh. Wow, that's a lot. Okay. I've got three days to figure this one out. Can I fire people here? No. Okay, so... Who am I going to kick? Who am I going to kick? Smith is pretty high up, but there is, I think there is a woman that has a 250. So that might be good. I would like some more detectives, just in general. But I don't have the, I don't have the manpower for that, or the budget for that. I might get rid of Chang. Drop him for somebody else. He's already got a Frank, that's what's pissing me off. Um, yeah, I think the A shift is actually the B shift is really nice. I don't really want to touch the B shift, especially since the lowest person is a woman. So like, oh my god, it's so stupid. This is so dumb. What the hell? All right. Hmm. We got 
21 people, 6 women. Yeah. Hmm. I just gotta start buying. Like, tomorrow, I'd have to. God damn. I'd have to let somebody off on uh, the next shift. I'm gonna just drop chat. I mean, like, I gave him a ranking, but, like, I have to drop if I wanna do this, this stupid mission. And watch the game messes me up, and it's like, oh, no, sorry, lol. <laughs> we don't even have enough women to hire. Eighty-six percent of residents oppose demolition of corn monument. That doesn't sound too popular. <sighs> Let's sip that morning coffee. Let's get back to Blick. Oh my gosh, that car sounded like it took a little longer. That's a pain in the ass. Ugh. Yeah, I, I'm, I won't let her come back, it's fine. Ranking, I'll deal with, I gotta deal with that later. <laughs> I just cannot, I can't be helped with working on it right now. Ugh, play that music. I'm in an awful situation here. Yeah, I'll take it all, it's fine. SWAT upgrade, nice. Oh, I can pick interesting. Definitely want more for the work. And I got everyone protect. Oh, that's so. That's so good. All right. B shift shit and does need an extra detective. I I'd like to have an even number of them, three and three. And we need a woman, so. Shirley Johnson, you are on the B shift. We're definitely way better candidates, but I've got this stupid mission I gotta do. Are you for real? This is what I mean. I can't even... Yo! Oh, I should have fired that guy when I had it. No, this guy is so grisly and so McNally. What the hell? <laughs> Poots. I don't believe this. I think this is going to be a failure. I, I can't. Oh, what now? The Sands family main attorney is underground around the clock, and that goes double for his children. But before we can pick them up from school this morning, some Vargas punks kidnapped them? We don't know how Vargas found them. They live under false names. Anyway, you'll need to act quickly. They haven't gone far. Let's send these two on. We'll crack some skulls, you two. Caddy, Purdy. Make them dirty. Oh, man. Let's see. I'm not going to still on the cold days. Okay. What? At the same school? Two senior students. Seniors at an elementary school. Begin to fight. Right in the middle of chemistry class, their teacher, Dolores, first tried to calm them down, but when she attempted to suffer too, she was poked in the eye. Oh, for God's sakes. It's in one person. This should not take more than two people. What, is the suspect gonna run away? I need a coffee on that one. 
that that amuses at the art museum? The Museum of Feelings and Fine Arts? What is this? At night, a little known painter by a little known painting by the Dutch master De Verum recently showed for the first time. Disappeared from the museum. One of the museum's windows was broken. And there's a brick lying on the floor inside. Ah, uh, you do it, Armstrong. I want to keep them all on just in case, because we keep seeing that things pop up. It does stretch these investigations out longer, which is a, very obnoxious, but... 11, 11, in progress. Drug sales? Miss Dunbar said a nurse tried to sell her drugs right in the hospital. <laughs> what? I went to the doctor after I broke my arm. The nurse heard me complaining about the pain and waited until the doctor left, and she started telling me about the pills she could get me. Better in Vicodin, according to her. I'm sure Chang wants to get in on that. Alright, let's send Austin and... Uh, I don't know. I really want to send two people. I'm really short staffed today. No matter what, I'll have only an odd person out. Alright, what happened here? Who escaped? How? How? You deserve that. I don't know how you you fucked that up, girl. But that was pathetic. That was bad, and you should feel bad. I'm mad about this. All right, theft. Uh, what? All right, I'm gonna wait until we got a little more on this one. Holy crap. That investigation's gonna take a minute, let me tell you. Drug sale. Hey! Better than I get it, huh? Cha ching! Sell that powder. What? Mr. Boyd! I'm a wealthy man, and I'm concerned about the fate of our fair city. I would like to fund three additional officer positions at your police department. But, I must make one condition. My adopted son is to take one of the new jobs. Of course, you mustn't fire him under any circumstances. Do we have a deal? Ooh, choices. So, we have some fuck-up kid, guaranteed to be a real pain in the ass. Who I'm not allowed to fire, and I'm gonna forget about it and fire him. Who wants to bet he's probably gonna have, like, a one-star, like, ability. Or, like, one-star ranking or some nonsense. But, I can replace him with two other people. Hmm. 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 I can, I have room for a fuck up in a, on a B shift. Not gonna lie. B shift wouldn't be too bad. And I am in need of uh, officers. Yeah, let's just see it. Oh my god. Oh, it's, it's fabulous. Well, you're literally replacing with Mr. D Officer Donut. <laughs> Grizzly's great, but seriously, we got a 302. Oh my gosh. Uh, let's see. So if I got one person here, one person here, I'm kind of resigned to to not be able to hire any women though. If I hire more men, especially some really good officers, but I'm gonna hold off. Someone grab the half. Oh my god, he really has like five. I, I gotta put him through something, and he's like tired. This guy's such a such a pain. 
Some goons grabbed the half-sister of one of, the, of our family members right off the street. Our driver called us from a nearby payphone, but he's a wimp. He couldn't actually do anything. The description we got sounds like Vargas men. Let's see, if they're the first, get hold of them, don't hurt them too much, just make sure you don't let them escape, a special plan for them. Ooh. Yeah, throw these two back in on it. Um, actually, oh no, 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 wait, wait, it's Deputy that does this. Yeah, let's, uh... Let's just get him some experience. Let's see what we can do about this. I'm kind of curious about this one, too. I'm going to just do it. Oh. Interesting. Do they go right now? I'll hold off. Yeah, I'm going to hold off on that. What I'm not going to hold off on is the jams. Oh. I do bait you open a lot. But that sweet ginger green, baby. Alright, who went what now? Center city center robbery. Parking Valley just called in, reporting that a girl exited an expensive car. Reported that a girl exiting an expensive car was approached by a man wearing a hood who threatened her and took her back. Well, that just sucks. Alright. Hey. Sano. You two. Take care of it. Do, 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 do. Assault. Oh. Hey, you're not as incompetent anymore, Sano. How's that feel? Diamond Dogs State Penitentiary. Is that sweet ginger green? It's funny. An older prisoner, tired of eating the food served by the prison cafeteria, made his way to the kitchen carrying a ship. Intent on having a word with the chef. The guard called police as he was reluctant to enter the kitchen for a further provoking the prisoner. That's ridiculous. So these three on it. Yeah. This has been one hectic day. But I think it's been productive. It's because that sweet ginger green, baby. Come on, something else gotta pop up. Ooh. Kitchen floor is decorated with broken plates and an overturned pan filled with muddy slush. An elderly prisoner is sitting on a stool, dipping his hands into the pot of slush, and shoving it towards the cook's face, yelling, You try eating this shit! I don't know. What is the sarcastic ass lines? This just seems rude and agitated. But, like, this seems like I'm just gonna aggravate him more. Let's cook something else. Up only takes a minute. I don't know what that's supposed to imply. Am I gonna burn this dude on the stove or something? Uh, I got a couple nice warm burgers here. Aw, I arrested him. Conveniently, he was in the prison. <laughs> Took no time at all. I need some more of that cocaine whenever I get it, huh? <laughs> Delicious Colombian. Coffee, I mean. Okay. Three more, huh? Oh. Well, so far, this is what it looks like. And 
we'll deal with it when it comes up. One more hour to go. Any more crazies coming out tonight? Not hearing much from Vargas. And that's the end of the day. 8-4. Looks like the Sand family is uh, taking out this Vargas crew. Oh, God, and he is drained. Ugh, this guy is going to... I don't like this guy at all. <laughs> Why do I get sent such assholes? <laughs> Damn it, city. I blame the mayor for this nonsense.